All right. Hello and welcome back to Man of Medan. Yes, we... Oh, I need to start the timer. We are just going to continue. <laughs> yeah, so we reached the other side. What side? See the... See the... Episode before this. Um. Alex? Julia? Hello? Maybe shut up? Maybe? Hello? Okay, a helicopter. Hmm. Help or some more bad guys? That's the question. Military should be or have been searching for this ship, I think. Even if it has been lost for all these years. <laughs> ah, this would have been the perfect end to end the episode before this, but. Anyway. Who's that? Who's there? Get away! Get away now. So we saw that we could jump down. I just want to explore everything up here before we jump down. I'm not hearing this. Bradley. Skeletons. Skeletons. Skeletons? It's not the first skeleton you have seen. Guys. Some sort of altercation. To the first officer Fisher. No, to first officer Fisher. Sir, you ask to kept informed of the radio situation. We are we attempted to outgoing message at the following times with no response. Hours, hours, hours. We were able to pick up indirect messaging traffic until 140 hours. Okay, so that's in the middle of the night. However, there has been no further incoming messages track at all since that time. It is possible that our radio equipment is faulty. I am investigation and expect to be able to report back to you at three. At night. So, could that be like is this the wrench she tried to pick up? Yeah. 
You're okay. not supposed to be out here. I'm not supposed to see this. A look. Find a now knife and a gas mask and spanner. Okay. I thought it. I thought it was a wrench. What? What is a wrench done? Okay, let's go down and die. Alex? Julia? Try the door one more time. Ah, I just wanted to drink. Whoa! I saw that shadow. Brad's voice, what? What is going on here? Yeah, because that's all in your head, I think. Or maybe they are connected like later on, but that has not happened with Brad. Uh, she is relaxed, though, and all innocent. Bullet. I don't know. I don't want to go there. But we have to. Oh, rats. Oh, man.
okay, I need I need time to breathe. What the fuck happened? Zombies? Okay, what's going on? <clears throat> Where the hell are we now? Back at this ship? Okay, so I wonder if this is all in her head. <clears throat> I was a little bit afraid of using the knife because I think this game will fool me at some point. So when I'm using the knife, <coughs> I will actually kill one of my friends. Um, I just have a feeling that something like that would and will happen. Um, but at that point, I just figured out that we must escape. Anyway, I'm relaxed. We Frank a little bit. So let's go. Where the hell are we? What in God's name is this? This is how the ship looked before. I guess. Explore the ballroom. It was something on this table. This place is not right. What is going on here? Mm -hmm. What the hell? Looks like a fuck you finger <laughs> in a pentagram. Two skulls on it. And blood? Oh no. Blood. The fountain of blood. Mm-hmm. Pretty big place. Yeah, I don't want to miss anything, so we need to go back. Do not, do not press. I told you. Why are you not listening to me? You will just bring the ghosts in. I told you. <laughs> okay, and I don't think it. I don't think there was anything down here. Nope. Okay. I just wanted to be sure. We have a door over there, but we want to see what the hell this is.
But there is a place we could hide. We could probably hide in there if we need to. <coughs> this is a strange book. Yeah. So we're dealing with some Satanists or whatever. Uh, I don't... Uh, okay. We're gonna read this, but I will not read it out loud. Uh, cable should silently. <laughs> Three female and two male firstborn. Then we got the seals. No, it is important to the sorcerer. Demons. Pent angle. Five primary points, yeah. Oh, is this something we need to do? How many are we? We got four friends. We got Brad, the girl girl's boyfriend and we got Conrad and we got Fliss we are currently five so yeah maybe we need to remember this that we should stand on the primary points whatever mm. uh, it is from there that the assembled should contain Incantation. We five stand at the first points, and then we have the pentagram. Yeah, we will see. Okay, so let me think. If we deal, if if we are dealing with some Satanist, this could, this dude could possibly be one of those. The question is, do they arrive with the shopper? Get to the shopper. Try to remember that we can. On for this, keep your head on straight. Hide. <sighs> I didn't mean to breathe. In your ear. I'm getting uh, tired, okay? Okay, what the hell happened? There he is. Okay, we could maybe have avoided if I didn't go there. <laughs> yeah, this is... to the happy room. Okay, what the fuck happened? So, basically, we killed death. I killed death. Mm.
ships in the night. Yeah, definitely, I don't know what time it is, but for sure. She stabbed the figure with a knife and run away. Uh, for sure something, it's, it's much more ghostly, so I, I'm guessing we are currently at night. Oh, yeah, 2.52 a.m. Yeah, so, ghost time is here. on you fucker go I don't think we can I have too much time to explore I don't want to fucking drown <sighs> no that's bullshit that's not him Oh. Got the ring back. No, take it. Kill all some. I wasn't sure what the hell was going on. I thought we were fighting. What? You. You okay? Yeah, or you. Take the knife. Thanks. I could have drowned. I'm sorry, but you did the right thing. It was him or us. Fuck! Ah, oh, it was not all so. Yeah, <gasps> what the... Super confused. I know uh, in a ghost story everything could be possible, but uh, okay, let me think this through a little bit. What would have happened if we hadn't drowned him? I don't think he would have been friendly all of a sudden. Like, oh, you guys help me. Best friends forever. Um, <sighs> the kitchen knife. After getting out of the water, something that looked like Alex. 
grabbed the knife. Ah, so this would maybe never have happened if we haven't picked up the knife. So now, now he has a knife. And um, that would probably not have happened. Okay, cool. Let's see, what the hell? <laughs> Brad, are you dead? You wanted to surprise me with the whole pirate adventure thing, and I gotta say it was a good idea. No, it was. What the hell was that? This game is so confusing now. Why did Brad die? I want to go back and see that again. Uh... No, what the fuck happened? Was was it Brad that we drowned? Ah, this is confusing. Uh, I need to watch this back later. I think the guys you hired are taking it a little too far, maybe. And don't be cheap. I mean, you didn't feel like paying top dollar, and that's you get. You get these guys that are not cream of the crop. They're taking it a little too far. You know, you get my drift? So if you want to feel free to pull the old plug, get rid of these guys. I'm with you. I mean... But I cannot let it go. I don't know what. So could we have a void? I don't, I don't know if Brad is dead. I don't, I don't. I'm confused. Confused. <sighs> Hello, girl. What's up? I think you should. Maybe it's something. It's wrong. Something is fucking. Me. No! 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 Was gonna die. Water purification plant with field nodes. Security operation man garrison mutation. Barracks Tower. Uh, we'll never remember this. Okay, that fucking music scares me. Mission, man overboard, ordered full stop and anchor at 1.28. I received reports of a man overboard and sure that all units under our command. Uh oh. This was no accident. I saw him jump.
4th Division Army to all officers, Captain Ford has ordered that the consumption of alcohol is strictly forbidden during this voyage. Any officer found drunk while on or off duty will face court martial. Your alcohol rations will be provided to you by a later date. This war is over. This is bullshit. Why he's suddenly by himself? Light. Grab. Light. Use. Okay, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> One more time. Not even one. It's a uh, messing with your head. In your hand. Zombies. <laughs> it's in your head. In your head. Probably not much of a practice with the preach kind of guy. Alcohol consumption. Okay. Something is really, really weird is going on. If anybody knew what the hell was going on in this place, it would have been the captain. Yeah, let's go and talk to him. Aye, aye, captain. Ouch, ouch. Uh, okay, that's the candle. Oh, oh, oh. See Daisy. Okay. Something will happen at that door. Yeah, I should really take a look behind this door, shouldn't I? Okay. But should I? Yeah, I should. Go. Go. <clears throat> Too strong. All right. So how do I pry the son of a bitch open? Door versus Conrad. Flawless victory. <laughs> I gotta find something to pry the door open. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Maybe that candlestick, whatever thingy. Pick up the phone. No, I don't think we should go all the way back here. Uh, we're gonna try that candle. If it doesn't work, well, then we have to search. 
Nothing to her. Shit, that was close. Oh man. <laughs> Are you gonna die? Too intense. Because we don't know when the quick fucking time event is coming, so we really have to be prepared. It's so fucking intense. Oh, okay, got it. Two, almost pressed the wrong again. Come on, Conrad. I'm so focused to watching for the fucking quick time symbol, so I don't even know what's going on in the story. <laughs> Except we are being sh fucking chased, but I don't have time to watch anything else. It's pretty cool, though. I will jump. Ah, that was wrong. What the hell? That was not a fucking jump. I was thinking confronting would be the Oh this is this is this is okay. This is gonna happen. Um No. Yeah, I'm a, I'm scared about that thingy, but yeah, this is 
this is this is uh, no this cannot happen fuck it he's here what's the matter dreambo don't care about me anymore We need a fucking break. Yeah, I, I think we paused really, really bad there because I don't know uh, uh, the time. Okay, we will try to continue. Let's see what options we have, left or right. Run. Shit. I'm not gonna jump anymore in this fucking game. Oh, so hard to get over that. We need to fucking fight. I pressed. I did. Oh, oh, Fliss. Oh, thank God. Yeah, it's me. Come on, let's go. And we're going to end it here. Okay. Uh, we must discuss two things before we end this episode. Brad. Is Brad actually dead? We just saw he, his body with blood. So I'm not really sure and I don't know why Brad died. Conrad. Conrad will be fucking killed, I think. I had the option to fight that beast or to jump, but I was thinking maybe to jump because hmm, there could be water or something, something soft, I don't know, but he fucking fell and yeah, hit the head on the fucking floor. So maybe a fight would be better, but... Hmm, I must try to see it like this because they they are ghosts and they are all in your head I, I'm thinking so f fighting that thing it, maybe he could f have fell off or lose the fight and fell off It's a possibility, uh, so we don't really know. Maybe that was a scripted thing. Conrad will maybe have died whatever we used. I don't know. But I f feel like uh, I feel like we didn't really. I mean. I feel a little bit, yeah, a little bit cheated, uh, because that was not a jump. Uh, it was more like a fall. So maybe we didn't actually choose jump quickly enough, and he fell off. Because I didn't really like that uh, thingy. So maybe we need to redo that and see what happens in in uh, another playthrough of this but yeah okay pretty pretty intense episode and uh, maybe two people are dead maybe brad and conrad is dead we don't really know for sure but i think i think at least conrad is and i also need to go back and watch what happened to brad because he was just dead all of a sudden i was like what <laughs> 
so yeah uh, uh, i will end this episode here and uh, see you in the next one so thanks for watching and uh, take care good evening good night and goodbye